Hi Ori, it's Travis here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we slayed some Fen Creepers for Rethiel the Green Warden. And he rewarded us with a new sword. And we also upgraded our first aid. We can now create heavy wool bandages. And today, we're going to be doing a quest for Sida. How are you? Sida. Seeing through the ooze. On my weekly visit to Ironbeard's tomb, I was attacked by dreadful dripping oozes. Naturally, I panicked. I threw my bag at one, but it didn't do anything. The ooze just sucked it right up. Luckily, it did give me some enough time to get away. The bad news is that I really need to get the contents of my bag. I don't know which ooze I threw my bag at. They all look the same. Ironbeard's tomb is northeast of here, near Dunbo Deer. Thank you very much. All right, so we have to uh, slay a bunch of oozes until we at Ironbeard's tomb, and then find Sita's bag. Be good. All right, so I think we've been to that tomb. I think that's up here. So it's going to be quite the journey. But we'll make it. This guy just having a t having the time of his life. Nice nap outside. Alright, so I guess we'll sprint here. Looking forward to trying this new sword. It has a chance on hit to blast the target for 35 nature damage. And yeah, we should be doing a decent amount of damage now. See how our elixirs are doing. I guess we'll make a couple of elixirs. There we go. Oh, this guy's uh, gray now. That's interesting. So we're getting kind of a, a little too high of a level. Do that. Another rogue over there. No warrior. Never mind. I wonder if he's doing hardcore. Yeah, everybody on this server seems to be doing hardcore. If there's anybody on. There's a couple people. It's not what it used to be, but it's cool that there's still people uh, in the community trying to hit 60. All right, so we're going to get this Briar Thorn here. That's going to be good. More healing potions for us. Great way for us to level up alchemy. Yeah, we're gonna have to fight some oozes. I'm not a fan of fighting oozes. They're kind of a pain. The ones that I hate the most are in Ungoro Crater. They, like, split up into more oozes after you, like, kill one. That's a place you could die easily, is Ungoro Crater. Ungoro Crater's pretty brutal. You have to watch out when we go there. You gotta watch out today, too. You never know what can happen. But our herbalism, it sure is getting up there. We're at 179. Almost at 200 herbalism. Pretty damn good. We haven't even got the Stranglethorn Veil yet. There we go. We got some Swift Thistle there. That was good. We will be using that for our Thistle Tea when we eventually finish that quest. 
and learn how to make it. That's another great way for us to level up our cooking as well as through thistle tea. See what our cooking's at. 117, yeah. We could, could use thistle tea right about now. How many swift thistle we have? Probably not too much. It's pretty rare. It's only six. We got some rent back, so I guess we'll cast that again. Never knew about these raptors over here. That's another thing we have to do is go back to the Welgar's excavation site and finish up that relic quest. I think it's artifact. We got a life root over here. Another Mage Royale, giving us another chance of getting some Swift Thistle. Watch out for these, uh, these raptors are pretty tough. Just try to sneak by them here. Oh, God. energy. I don't know. will be okay. damage there. Not enough energy. Get up. Okay, just let's have a bite to eat and we'll just stealth. That was scary. I thought we were gonna die to those raptors. We got a debuff on us called infective wound. Infected wound. Physical damage taken increased by six. Yeah, let's try to get out of here. These raptors are pretty lethal. I think we're good for now. And we'll use the other elixirs that we have we're gonna have to make a minor defense pot and there we go you're fully elixir gotta watch out sprinting by seems like the raptors are it's like endless raptors it just doesn't stop got some bruise weed over there that we can get though I think that's the tomb over there. If I'm not mistaken. I wonder if we can run through these two. Yep. Here we are at Ironbeard's tomb. Here are the oozes that we need to fight. Seems to be 
Some herbs here we can get as well. There's grave moss. Inside and outside. I'm out of range. We can make these things leave. Oh yeah, we well, that's the nature of uh blast. Oh, we already got side as big. Alright. Well, we got pretty damn lucky, guys. <laughs> I guess we'll go explore a little bit. I didn't think we were going to get Sida's bag that quick. Usually, uh, Classic doesn't work out like that. Okay, so we got to watch ourselves. Pull two are going to be in a lot of trouble. I'm also not sure what these Crimson Oozes even do. So... We'll fight this guy. Let's see what he does. So I can... I don't have anything. Maybe when we pull two, what does this do? Damage. I don't have enough. Am I gonna have to run? I don't have enough energy. My ability isn't ready yet. Not enough energy. It's a close call. Kill him. Alright, so we got them down. Looks like they don't put a debuff on you, so that's good to know. We don't have uh, an evasion or health pod right now, so gotta be pretty careful. Let's see what's down here. really bad now. I don't know if we're going to be going exploring now. <laughs> we won't have vanished. Uh, should I wait until it's back up? Damn it! Why did that thing have to pull while I was eating? I tried to I stealth. Not ready yet. I actually wanted to go down there and explore a little bit. Really all we would have found is a grave moss, but it's a good reward. We got um five minutes on the vanish. The health pot's back up. The evasion will be up somewhat soon. Hey, he came up. He's got friends everywhere. Yeah, it's pretty dangerous. I'm not going to be doing that. Sorry, guys. I kind of have to value my life here. <laughs> it's a little too dangerous. I'm not dying to a news. There's no way. So I guess we will be heading back. Too big of a baby to go down there without Vanish. It looks like that place is totally surrounded. Like, if you pull one, you're pulling two. And then if I pull two, I'm most likely dead. So we are going to hearth back to good old Menethil Harbor. We're going to turn this quest in. Looks like our bags are full anyways. Oh, we got another guy. Hardcore. 60 hardcore priest. Never seen death. Very impressive. Congratulations to that guy. Smite Goodman. Still living. I wonder if that was his warrior. What's on your mind? Now we'll get rid of this oil. 
any yeah, raptor eggs. Anything else I guess we can keep. We got a lot of herbs on us. We're gonna have to get rid of some of that. Alright, so let's go and uh, turn this quest in. It's dripping. Side his bag is dripping. Great to meet ya. You find my bag? Oh, thank you, 007. I was afraid that it was lost for good. She quickly empties the contents of the ooze-covered bag onto the ground before scooping them up. Hmm. I don't have much use for this anymore, but wash it off, and I'm sure you can make use of it. Keep your what? feet on the ground. We just got a ten-slot bag, guys. That is awesome. That helps out so much. That was really good. You're really lucky to get that. So we've been having bag issues for a while. Great to meet you. Get rid of this bone. Not if there's anything else for us to make. Watch your back. It doesn't seem like it. Actually, we could have made Murloc Finn soup. How are ya? See you soon. You got any what hot spices on ya? you? Damn it, we should start farming. Maybe we'll do that. We gotta start saving these murloc fins. I didn't know I could make murloc fin soup. It's pretty good too. You get six damn six spirits. It's a little bit. It's pretty damn good. If we farm a bunch of murlocs and get our cooking up right up to 150. Off with you. Might actually do that. But I don't know if we'll do that today. I think we will save that for next episode, guys. But yeah, we got a new bag. And we sold a bunch of stuff. And I think next episode we may head over to Ironforge. Or maybe we'll go to Ironforge now. Should we go to Ironforge now? Actually, no, we'll wait. We still got bag space. Just thinking about going back there just so we could um, maybe put some. Some of these, like, uh, herbs away. Because we got so many herbs now. Yeah, we'll just chill. There's still a lot of uh, quests I want to do in Menethil Harbor before we leave. And we don't have to really worry too much about bag space. But yeah, guys, that is going to be the end of today's episode. As always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.